Hello boys and hello girls. How are you boys and girls? Yes, of course, I hope you are very, very good, great and fantastic as every, every day. Como todos los días, chicos. Today is our last class. Yes, of course, nuestra última class. Very, very good. But... As you know it, we have to continue with our class. Tenemos que continuar con nuestra clase, chicos. Today we are going to do a reading. Vamos a hacer una lectura. Yes, it's very interesting. Es muy interesante. We are using, vamos a usar, the verb to be in positive and the verb to be in negative in the same sentence. Vamos a usar el verbo to be positivo y el verbo to be negativo en la misma oración. So, let's start. Vamos a empezar, ok, chicos. Dice así, the first. I am tall. I am tall. What is tall? Tall, an adjective, un adjetivo. Alto. I am tall. Yo soy alto. It is positive or negative? Of course, miss, it is positive. Por supuesto que es una oración positiva. Let's see. What the other sentence says. Vamos a ver qué es lo que sigue diciendo mi oración. I am tall, but I am not thin. I am tall, soy alto, but, pero, I am not thin. No soy, what is thin, que es thin, delgado, flaco, ¿no, chicos? Very good. We can use positive and negative in the same sentence, ¿no? But, always remember, siempre recuerden, that when we use but, que cuando usamos este conector, el but, it's because we are going to talk about the or the opposite in the next sentence, ¿no? Es porque vamos a usar en mi siguiente oración, esta es una primera oración, esta es la siguiente, ¿no? Vamos a contradecir la primera, ¿ok? This is positive, this is negative. It's the opposite, es lo contrario, lo contradecimos. Yes, of course, me, ¿no? Very interesting. Repeat after me. Repitan después de la mis. I am tall. I am tall. But I am not. But I am not thin. Thin. One more time. Very quickly. Más rápido. I am tall, but I'm not thin. One more time, una vez más. I am tall, but I am not thin. Excellent, very good. Let's see the other. Vamos a ver el siguiente, dice así. Jane is not at home. Jane is not at home. Jane no está en casa. Jane is not at home. She is at work. She is at work. Jane no está en casa. A ver, siempre el positivo va a ir en la primera parte. Of course not, Miss. Here the first is negative. Aquí la primera parte está en negativo, ¿no? Very good. Dice así. Jane is not at home. Jane no está en casa. She is at work. She is at work. Ella está en el trabajo. Very good. Again, repeat after me. Jane is not at home. Again, boys and girls. Jane is not at home. She is at work. Again, she is at work. Excellent. Very good. The other sentence. Mi siguiente oración dice así. You are Spanish. You are Spanish. Tú eres Spanish. Español. You are Spanish. Tú eres español. You are not French. You are not French. Tú no eres francés. Excellent. You are Spanish. You are not French. The first is positive. The other is negative. I'm talking about a person. Very good. Again, repeat after me. De nuevo, repiten de nuevo. Después de la misma. You are Spanish. You are Spanish. You are not French. You are not French. 
Excel. Very good. Let's see the other. Vamos a ver el siguiente. Mi siguiente oración dice así. And and I, and and I, and and I, and y yo, are cousins. Are cousins. Somos primas. Excelente. Recuerden que para sacar el verbo to be yo puedo reemplazar an en I por un pronombre. ¿Cuál es el mejor pronombre para reemplazarlo? We, nosotros, excelente. O nosotras, recuerden que no hay género. An and I are cousins. An y yo somos primas. We are not sisters. We are not sisters. No somos hermanas, excelente. We are not sisters. No somos hermanas because we are cousins. Porque somos primas. Yes, very good. Repeat again. Repitan después de la misa de nuevo. Anne and I are cousins. Again. Anne and I are cousins. We are not sisters. We are not sisters. Excellent, very good. The other sentence. Mi siguiente oración dice así. It is dark. Repeat again. It is dark. It is dark. I'm talking about the moment. Estoy hablando acerca del momento, del tiempo, ¿no? Del lugar. It is dark. Está oscuro. ¿Qué cosa? The place where I live, el lugar donde yo vivo. It is dark. Está oscuro. It is not late. It is not late. Está oscuro, pero no significa que sea tarde o de noche para que esté oscuro. No. Therefore, I'm surprised. Por eso estoy sorprendida. It is dark. Está oscuro. It is not late. No es tarde, ¿no? It is dark. Está oscuro. It is not late, pero no es tarde. Very good. These are expressions that maybe you can use in a sentence. Very good, boys and girls. Finally, finalmente. Oh, I'm sorry, we have to repeat this. Tenemos que repetir esto. Repeat after me. It is dark. Repeat. It is dark. It is not late. It is not late. Excellent. Very good. Now, yes, we are going to see the other. Ahora sí vamos a ver los siguientes. This is the last sentence. Dice así. My shoes are dirty. My shoes are dirty. Mis zapatos están sucios. Are not old. Are not old. Mis zapatos están sucios, pero no están viejos. Old, an adjective, no un adjetivo. My shoes are dirty. Are not old. Excuse me. Mis zapatos están sucios, pero no están Viejos. Excellent. Repeat after me. My shoes are dirty. Again. My shoes are dirty. Are not old. Again. My shoes are dirty. Are not old. No están viejos. Very good, boys and girls. These were very interesting because we are practicing our pronunciation. Estamos practicando nuestra pronunciación. Now copy this, boys and girls. Me la van a copiar en su cuaderno, okay, chicos? Now, yes, the last class of this year. Nuestra última clase. I hope you have or you will have a great vacations. Espero que tengan unas grandiosas vacaciones. And a great new year. Y un grandioso año nuevo. Okay, chicos. Very good. Now you can relax and take a time to think all we have learned. Pueden relajarse y tomarse un tiempo para repasar lo que ya hemos aprendido, ¿no? And enjoy your time. Y disfrutar del momento. Take care and goodbye, boys and girls.